Why, hello again, children. It's Jekyll again, after a very maddening experience in some LSD hallways. Yes, the back rooms are filled with machine elves, and now Jekyll needs something quick and easy. Something digestible. We're going to be playing Ducku Dog. Ducksu. Start game. You find yourself in the middle of nowhere. You have no idea how you got here. Nor do you know where you are. You see someone strange approaching. Technically everyone I don't know is a stranger, and that makes them strange. But not in that sense, you perverts. Press spacebar for next text. Yeah, he is pretty strange. Hello there. I'm so happy to see someone else. Is that hat part of your head, or... Is it just a hat of the same color? I'm not going to judge. Like, I'm more concerned about what this is growing out of your face. It looks like a duck bill, but you don't look like a dog. You look more like a cat in a hat with some kind of flippers. I've been here all by myself for quite some time. As you should have been, you eldritch demon. Hey, do you want to meet my friends? Friends? Wait one second. You see, when you're all alone, you tend to make friends from whatever you can find. Why is this one burned? How did it get burned? How did it get burned? I, I don't like the, the fact that they're like brain cases are opened up. But you know what? If that's all you can do to stuff them, I guess that's fine. It's usually better just to shrink the skulls and attach the arms that way when you're making friends out of friends. I hope we can be friends. I'd rather not be. Hey, can I ask a favor? You want my skin? I've lost my pet squirrel. Can you find her? I last saw her at the cabin in the woods. Don't worry. She's not a plush like these. She's real. For now. A real friend. I've got a few things to do, but I'll meet up with you here later. Bye, friend. Gross. Can I leave? Okay. Uh-huh. I don't know what that was. Uh-huh. You've managed to escape the bizarre creature you met, but barely. It does not follow you past the field of corn. Only its fading screams can be heard. You are grateful that what was night is now day. You have no idea of what just happened, but are glad it's over. Uh, we're gonna do that again. We need to find that squirrel. Someone strange approaching, we saw this, blah blah blah. Friend, you want me to find your squirrel? I know, I know, duck dog. Um... Is there no squirrel? Like, am I just doing this for no reason? Like, I, I, I wanted to find the squirrel. I'll tell you what, Duck Dog, you can have my skin. Go ahead and take it. You died. Fantastic, that's all it was. You died. There was never any squirrel, was there? I, I knew I shouldn't have trusted that weird eldritch demon. Like, usually, if they want something from you, they'll just ask, and they'll give you something in return. You can give them a part of your soul, a part of your body, maybe even your life, you know? They can use you as an eternal battery. But this Ducku Dog? No. No, he, he. I don't know what he wanted. He didn't even make a deal. Very hostile from the beginning. As far as the Eldritch Horrors I've met have gone, he's very rude. I would give him a zero out of five stars on Yelp. Um, three out of five stars? No, that's too, too nice. The game was too short. There was no squirrel. I'll tell you what, children. Jekyll will give uh, Ducku Dog two and a half stars. No, two and a half cigarettes out of five. Yeah. Interesting game. Good abomination. I like the part where his hat was part of his skull. 
Yeah. See you next time, children. Jekyll out. <laughs> <laughs>